A teenager has successfully hacked the only trillion dollar company on earth, Apple. Oh, and he stashed the files in a folder named Hacky Hack Hack. Of course he did. Welcome back to IO, I'm Charlotte Dobre. Here's an idea, if you want to work for the most valuable company on earth, but don't know how to get their attention, just hack into their system. They'll notice you then for sure. Or you know, just don't. <laughs> An Australian teenager from Melbourne successfully hacked into Apple's corporate computer network and downloaded 90 gigabytes of customer data and internal files. But it's actually unclear what kind of data exactly was stolen. Apple has been understandably very secretive about what happened. I mean, a teenager hacked into their system. That doesn't sound very promising, does it? He actually hacked into Apple multiple times over the course of a year. This is super funny because Apple servers are widely believed to be unhackable but even a teenager can do it apparently. Though he probably was a bit smarter than your average teenager. The hack was apparently flawless before Apple found out. When Apple caught wind of the hack, they contacted the FBI. The FBI contacted the Australian Federal Police and from there, the teenager's home was raided. Inside the house, they found two laptops with serial numbers that matched the devices that did the hacking. Word of advice, if you ever wanna hack a trillion dollar company, don't brag about it on WhatsApp because that's how he got caught. He told others using WhatsApp that he hacked into Apple's corporate computer network Work, and he told them the files were in a folder called Hacky Hack Hack. We don't know much about this hacker. His name can't be shared because he's a minor. We do know that he's 16 years old and a private schoolboy whose dream was to work for Apple. He's also a very well known individual in the international hacking community. What better way to get Apple's attention than to hack into their system? Problem is, the hacker is going to court to face sentencing on September 20th. He pleaded guilty to the charges. So it's probably unlikely that they're gonna hire him at this point. Just, uh, I guess. Apple made a public statement assuring customers that at no point during this incident was their personal data compromised. Okay guys, it's time to respond to some comments. See the comment ads, comment ads. Michael Ramos says, your dance is just so cringe. Your face is just so cringe. Mm. That cheap channel said, I started to get really anxious because you reminded me that I have to go back to school. I am very sorry to remind you, but yes, school is starting again. Some of you have started already. But one thing I've always loved about going back to school was getting new gel pens. Oh God, I miss gel gel pens. They smelled so good. Kids these days don't know what it was like to have a new gel pen. You guys all have computers. Spencer last said, I just came here for the like to dislike ratio. I feel like our ratio is pretty good compared to other channels. Unless we do a video on Keemstar or Ninja, then the dislikes come in hot. So hot. Evelyn M said, who else is cutting their toenails while watching this? Nope, just me. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah, it's it's probably just you. Welcome to the end screen. This means the video is over. If you had a good time watching this video, smash the thumbs up, subscribe, and notification bell. Do you want to go on an IO binge? Well, we put together a playlist of a ton of videos just like this one. That's right over there. By the way, both me and IO are on Instagram. Make sure you follow us. Our links are posted in the description. That is it for me, and I'll see you in the next IO video.